What is going on everybody? Today we're gonna do a little bit of gaming. I know I always say that I want to do more of this on my channel and this is gonna be one of those times where I finally actually do and I don't know how many of you out there are like me but when I see people playing Mario and they're doing these levels that are absolutely insanely hard I'm intrigued by that. I wish I could hang with the big dogs but I can't quite yet but there are a series of levels on Mario Maker uh, made by a user named Carl who also has a YouTube channel. I believe it's Carl Sagan 42. I'll annotate that if I'm wrong. But uh, he made a series of levels called Kaizo College that basically teach you some of the, the, the sort of tweaks that are used very often in the Super Mario World format for these insane Kaizo style levels. Um, they're more of a beginner's type of uh, introduction to them, and except for the first one of them, this one, Pee All You Can Pee, uh, that is actually some pretty high-level P-switch jumping, which I could not even clear. But for, for other people who want to uh, learn how to do this kind of stuff, I think it's a lot of fun. And for me, I like going back to them. I've played most of them, but I like going back to sort of hone some skills. So... Let's get it underway. We are taking uh, basically the second assignment of Kaizo College because I failed the first one. Press P to jump. So this is going to teach us basically uh, a little bit more about P-switch jumping. And, and the beginnings are pretty basic. And he's got these doors set up so that you can you know fix your mistakes and whatnot. So basically it's as simple as that. When you land on a P-switch, you have a couple frames in which you can... Uh, actually jump off of it. I can't believe I got that second one first try, but uh, I did, so that's cool. So that's that's a little bit of P-switch jumping. Basically, what you do is while you're in the air, you drop the P-switch uh, just to wait at the perfect time to where you can land on it and then jump and you can therefore propel yourself a little bit higher. Uh, didn't quite get the world record of three and a half seconds there, but that's fine. Um, anyway, that's the first course of Kaizo College in the books. I would give myself an A for that class right there. Shall we jump? Now this is where things get a little bit trickier. And uh, it's not going to be all sunshine and rainbows like it was that first level. This, I believe, is an intro to shell jumping. Um, this, we just got to spin jump off that guy. So for the sake of having a little safety, I'm going to wear this helmet. Oh my gosh. First try. Okay. That one. Whoops. Okay, let's see if we can do this again. Whoop, I gotta actually release it. That'll help. Nope, missed it. Oh, mushroom. That is kind of irrelevant. Got it. Okay. Second try on a shell jump. Maybe I'm actually getting there. I don't know. I, I'm a long, long ways from being able to hang with the likes of the guy that actually makes these levels, Carl Sagan. Uh, he is fantastic at this. Um, I would have to say one of the best in the world. Um, there's obviously a couple other... Uh, you know, mainly streamers that do this. Uh, Grand Pooh Bear is one that's fantastic. Uh, Panga, obviously, is basically a legend of making some of the hardest levels on this game. Um, but yeah, so that's a little intro to shell jumping. The next one is is a little bit, a uh, little bit more Kaizo College Spring Break. So this one is a little bit of, uh, I guess, applying some of the skills that we've learned so far into uh into taking it a little further i hope i don't die too many times with this so okay so we're gonna i'm just gonna have to spin oh i can need that spring though so if you if you time your jump oh ideally not into a fireball <laughs> but if you if you time your spin jump correctly if i could actually do it correctly um you will you'll pick up the the spring as well, which is crucial. So right now we gotta kick that up there, and oh, that'll take those guys out. Sweet. I don't know if I still need the spring, but I'm gonna have it just in case. Oh yeah, I do. So this is in a lot. This is like a P switch jump, essentially. Only you're doing it with a spring now. There you go. I did it. All right. And then there's always those fancy contraptions at the end. Um, so yeah, same thing with the P-Switch jump. You, you let it go as you're about to hit your apex, basically, to where it's just below you as you start coming down. You land on it, and, uh, and there you go. So, nailed spring break. That's perfect, because all my roommates are away on spring break right now. Um, me, I'm, I'm not. I'm here. I'm making videos. So, 
Kaizo College Study Buddy. This one, if I remember right, involves a lot of Yoshi. You've got to basically save him, or at least have him be a part of things. I've played these levels once or twice each. Okay, yeah, so he's coming from the top, and I died. <laughs> you got to time your jump to where you actually land on Yoshi. Got it, okay. So you can bounce off that, or bounce off the, the spinning blades at that point. Oh, I needed to get him out of the way, too. Okay. Um. Oh, shoot. I'm dead. Okay. I just gotta start over. So you gotta spit that uh, spring out far enough to where it will hit that uh, the other shell to knock the, the pow. So. There we go. Whoa. Oh, shit. Dang it. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Like I said, it's gonna be ta it's gonna take a handful of go-arounds here. Oh my gosh, really? I was thinking if I could get back to the beginning there, another Yoshi egg would come out. And it would have, but uh, I didn't didn't survive the jump. Okay. Alright, let's... There we go. Alright, now we gotta bounce off these guys. Nice, okay. Um... What do I want to do with this? Did I want to? I probably didn't want to eat that, huh? Or maybe not have mattered. Let's see. Oh, jeez. Oh, no! Why did it bring me all the way back here? Now I'm dead. <laughs> Dang it! Okay. Let's get this right this time. All right, back to bouncing. Oh, I gotta spit the pow to kill those guys to land the jump. Okay, like I said, I've played this level once before maybe, and it was a minute ago, and uh, so all the details are not entirely clear. There we go. Okay. Whew. All right. Whoops. Okay. Got. Oh no! There's a turtle. They got me. <laughs> Dang it. Okay. Well, I'm making progress at least, bit by bit, death by death. Oh, what the hell? Get rid of that guy. There we go. Oh no! I spit it too hard? I I nailed the shell to where it didn't roll and hit the pow. <laughs> I didn't know that was possibly a thing. Okay, well. New mistakes happen. Kaizo levels, you know, even the best of the best. What is going on with that? Even the best of the best take, uh, you know, hundreds of attempts, sometimes more, to beat the most difficult levels. Why does that keep... I'm sorry, that's... Let's try again. <laughs> okay, there we go. Alright. Got it, there we go. Back in business. Okay, don't get hit by the, uh, the Koopa Troopa here. There we go. Something tells me I need this. And I needed that, too. Shoot, die. I hope that doesn't take me too far back. Oh. Oh, no. Shoot. I didn't mean to go back in there. Okay. Alright. Oh, crud. I didn't jump in time. Alright, I see what you gotta do. This is where some serious timing comes into play. So you've gotta run... And jump and spit that one pow. There we go. So you gotta spit a pow up top to hit the first layer of chompers. And then grab the second pow, spit that. And, uh, make her, or get out of the way with Yoshi. I almost made that slide. Holy cow. Oh, something tells me I'm gonna need him. Alright. 
Okay, we're gonna run and jump. Oh, I need to spit him. Dang it! Okay, I need to spit him, jump him, and then shell jump off of him. So, oh, this is the last little bit of it, though. Oh, there we go. Ah, I spit him too soon. Those arrows really are accurate. Um, and it's good. It gives you a good idea of exactly how the timing will go a lot of the time with things like these. Got it? Yeah! All right. Okay, so that is, uh, that's a little bit of a study buddy action so far with some Kaiser College. Is that four courses I beat already? We did, we did the P-Switch, we did the Shell Jump, we did Spring Break, and now Study Buddy. So, yeah, okay. Well, I'll call that part one of a little bit of Kaizo College going on because it does get a little bit harder, I'm pretty sure. So, yeah, we did Study Buddy, Spring Break, uh, P, press P to jump, and Shell we jump. So, that is, uh, that's a little bit of Kaizo College so far. Stay tuned for the midterm exam. Uh, that is where... Things get a little bit crazy, if I remember right. Uh, so, yeah, should be a fun one. Stay tuned. Uh, yeah, we'll do some more Kaizo stuff. Peace!